since I just turned on my camera and vlogged a normal day. But today's not a normal day because it feels like fall outside, which is a really big deal when you live in Texas. It is quite literally October. I woke up this morning to it being 66 degrees out. I think it's now like 70 something, but I'm feeling so special because when is it ever like that in Texas? In October. Like, oh my gosh, the vibes are immaculate outside. I definitely need to get outside today. How do you feel about this, Phoenix? He's like, I wanna go outside. My coffee is finishing up brewing, and then I can show you guys my immaculate coffee that I make. So yes, I'm your basic girl that fall is my favorite season. Uh, I don't care how basic it is, there is a reason so many people love fall, and nothing tops fall, like literally nothing. I already decorated for fall. I kind of have decorations for fall up all year round because those are just the colors that I like, but I do specifically have like a pumpkin and some fall flowers. I have a bunch of stuff that I'm gonna show you guys that I bought, some of it for fall and some of it just stuff. So we'll do a haul a little bit later in the video, but let me show you how I make my coffee first. Gotta clean my coffee cup because I actually already had coffee this morning. I like using cups like this way better than just normal mugs because they're like ceramic and actually stay warm. Cause as soon as my coffee gets like lukewarm, I'm, I'm done, I don't want it. So first I'll put in a pack of Trubia. This is my favorite like zero sugar sweetener. Sometimes I'll put cinnamon, but I've kind of been tired of it recently, so I'm not doing that today. Then I'll add a little bit of this sugar-free vanilla syrup, just a teensy bit. Then, this is where things get a little bit crazy, and you might be like, what? But I promise, it's amazing. I add butter to my coffee. I'm doing like a high-protein, high-fat diet right now, low-carb. So, the more butter, the better for me. It is very important to have lots of fat when you're not having that many carbs. And let me tell you, this makes your coffee so creamy and nice. Also, I just wanna throw it out there, just cause I'm eating low carb doesn't mean you have to, doesn't mean I recommend, it's just something that I'm doing for myself. It's been working really well for me, so. Then, of course, add my coffee. And it like melts the butter into the coffee. It's literally beautiful. So I use, well, cause it's fall, of course. This is actually almost empty and I got it like not even that long ago, but zero sugar pumpkin spice creamer. So good. Stir that all up with my straw. Look, it's like steaming. I love that. Cheers. Ooh, hot. Oh my gosh, that is so good. Like the butter, just a little bit of butter, it makes it immaculate, it really does. Part of my haul, I got this Target. What? I got this candle from Target. It's like crackling. It's got three wooden wicks. It is a beautiful smell. This one is the Whiskey and Oak Crackling Wood Wick. And these are beautiful candles and just gives amazing fall vibes. I don't care that it was more expensive because it's worth it. I genuinely can't believe that I'm a wake up and make coffee every day type of girl. Sometimes I even have coffee like before bed. Who am I? Never thought this would be me. Oh, it's so good. I need to wait for it to cool down a bit. And it takes forever to cool down in these cups, but then it stays warm forever. So I have all my stuff I just keep on the table to do my Bible study. I haven't been reading up in my cute little nook as much because I really need to get a table for up there because I like to take notes and highlight and it's just really nice to have a table when doing that. Also my table is literally just a white fold out table because I don't really want to pay to get a table. This one works fine. I hardly ever eat at it anyway. I eventually do want to get a table, but I'm still just looking for like a really good deal. Before I hop in my Bible study, I think I just want to go enjoy some fresh air. I brought this side table up that I had downstairs. I really never use it downstairs. It's still kind of awkward for like taking notes and stuff, but I think it'll definitely work for now. So I can do my Bible study up here.
social media manager for a company and I work Monday through Friday. So I'm pretty tired. Earlier, all those clips that were filmed was during what should have been my lunch break and I was planning on making food, but then I got distracted. I'm pretty sure I didn't take an actual hour break. I'm really hungry and I need to eat. And I'm gonna make steak, which might seem super like random to have steak for like lunch. I don't know, I just really love steak. I eat steak a lot actually. I just buy it in big packs at the grocery store keep it in a glass container and then I get to have steak whenever I want. So I've been watching the latest season of The Circle on Netflix. So I'm gonna watch that and make my steak. Oh my gosh. That is literally amazing. I don't know how I'm so good at making steak, but it is so good. Okay, bye, I'm leaving, love you. My boyfriend got home from work, and as you saw, I was saying goodbye to him because I'm going to pick up my friend, Sasha. So remember how I said I woke up and it was 66 degrees out? It's 84 now. Here, let's get a good feel for it. It actually does feel really good. It's not like a hot 84. It's like a cool 84, which honestly 84 is still like a pretty good temperature. I filmed the first part of this video on Friday. It is now Sunday. I spent Friday night hanging out with one of my friends and I just wanted to be in the moment. And then I don't even remember anything about Saturday. I'm pretty sure I slept like most of the day. But I wanted to continue this like fall style video and give you guys the haul of all my fall stuff and vlog. One of my favorite things is this pumpkin candle. It smells like pumpkin and it is a pumpkin and it has a pumpkin lid. It's so cute and this is my favorite candle to have in my room. I went to Target today and I was gonna get another one but they only had the big ones and I like the small one for in here for the background of filming. The reason I went to Target again today is because my boyfriend wanted a new candle. So I got another new candle. This one is soft cashmere and lavender. It's literally beautiful but I think I'm gonna put this one downstairs. And then I got a few new clothes. So my first shopping haul for fall, I just got two things. These are from TJ Maxx. First is this shirt. I literally don't own any like nice blouses, so I finally got one. I've actually been loving this. I thought I would low-key hate it, but it's perfect because I need to wear like nicer long sleeve shirts for my videos for work, so love it. And then same with this. This is also for work, but it's a little bit more casual. Definitely still works though. And it's got like a cute little collar and it's a nice sweater. It's so soft, it has pockets. And these are both from TJ Maxx. And then my three new favorite t-shirts. This is from a brand called He Would Love First. I have this in a sweater, but I got it in a t-shirt. It says, I love Jesus, is a smiley face. I got these in like a little pack, so they're all from the same brand. This one just says, oh, oh, you can barely see it. It says good news for the cross. I love this one. I low-key want the hoodie in this as well. And then I'm wearing the third one. This is the first shirt I ever saw from them. It's so cute. So it's a lion, it says WWJD, what would Jesus do? And then he would love first. I think that's it for clothes. Today at Target, I got a new mug. Uh, it's just black and I love it because I don't have just like a simple black mug, which is literally just my vibe, so. And then I know I already showed my coffee corner, but I got my new coffee maker, but I also got all of this stuff over here. Well, not all of it. Well, obviously at one point I got it, but this thing that everything's sitting on for my coffee corner, I got a TJ Maxx. And then I already had these, so I don't know where they're from. And then also today, I finally got stools. I got two stools, one for me and my boyfriend, at the, what is this called? Counter? Island? It comes with two different legs, so this is the tall legs, there's also short legs. Kind of wish it went with short legs, because like the seat's kind of awkward, but I do not feel like putting it back together. But it swivels! So I'm trying to get better about not randomly spending money on things I, in the long run, don't really need. So I think I did pretty good with the things that I've bought in this like little haul because I actually needed most, if not all of it. As you can see, I just put those stools together right now. Oh, and my boyfriend got me roses. Mm. Next thing I need to do is continue preparing my lesson for Tuesday, teaching Hebrews. I only got a few verses done over this last week because there's just so much. So I'm gonna work on that. the last little bit but the sun literally went down while I was doing that kind of like oh I wanted to watch the sunset but I was so focused on getting the lesson done so now I thought it'd be fun to like curate just a super cozy fall evening routine or I guess not a routine because I'm probably not going to continue to do it but let's just get some fall vibes So cozy. 
they may not be coming through the screen, but it is happening. I've got my favorite fall candle, a fall little pumpkin coffee drink, and I do so badly wish that I was a cozy up with a book type of girly. I'm more of a cozy up with a movie type of girly, but I do want to read both of these books. They're Christian books. We have The Screw Tape Letters by C.S. Lewis and Classic Christianity by Bob George. I know these are both bangers and I've wanted to read them for a long time, so I think I'm going to try to read a few pages of one of them. Then I will be my cozy up with the movie girly. <laughs> gonna read for five. I guess this book is pretty good. Before I end this video, I want to show you this outfit. It is such fall vibes and I finally got my pants in. Here, I'll show you over here. I got these little lemon pants a couple weeks ago, but they were too long. I am 5'1", but they hemmed them perfectly to where they barely don't touch the ground and then I can wear my boots with them and it's literally perfect. And I also just wanted to say that I continued reading that book last night, Classic Christianity, for like two hours. The book was literally so good, blowing my mind. So I actually might become a reader because I thoroughly enjoyed that and have been reading more than I've been watching shows. So it might be a thing for me, but I'm really feeling the fall vibes right now. It's a nice temperature outside. It's like fall-ish in my house. New candle smells are always amazing and I love pumpkin and all that. So fall is definitely my favorite season, just like many people, but that's fine. So that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, hit subscribe, give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.